For Passover, now presenting Yehuda brand Gefilte fish, a kosher delight. This product of Israel can be enjoyed at room temperature or cold from the fridge. It contains fresh caught carp soaked in water along with matzo meal, carrots, onions, and egg whites. Me and my big mouth. You might remember in the last review when I reviewed the ginger candies that I said. Up the ante, you know? I'm not gonna get any viewers unless I do anything hardcore. How do you even eat this? I mean, it is so... It looks like a turd floating in pee water. It might be a turd floating in pee water. It is so nasty. And what are all these bits and carrots and like, maybe that's little bits of vomit in there. Maybe there's... And you know, I don't want this to come across as me like, bragging on anybody of the Jewish faith. I understand there's lots of people, for, like for Passover and all that, who would eat this gladly, and I don't know if they like the taste of it, or I don't know if they're required to, to eat it from their religion, but I have nothing against your religion. I myself, when I was alive, I was an atheist, and then I found out otherwise, as you'll see, but I don't want to harp on that. I just, to me, I mean, not to sound eth ethnocentric or nothing, this is Foul. This is like, I've never heard of a gefilte. You know, anytime I see like Jacques Cousteau or like, like IMAX at the ocean, do you ever see a gefilte fish like floating around? I don't know. Is it a creature? Is it something that was man-made like in a laboratory? Oh God. All right, well, just so you know, listen for the pop. I didn't do any try runs on this. Uh oh, it's all wet. Alright, there you go. It's been de-virginized, it is open, and there's all sorts of slime running down the sides of it already. Alright, you know what? I'm actually almost more scared to smell this than I am to taste it. But, I can smell it from here. Ah! <laughs> it smells like a mixture of, like, like fish and sauerkraut. It's like... <laughs> And I hate sauerkraut, too. And it just looks like... It looks like someone sat on a pickle and just kept sitting on it like they're just pasting it with their buttocks. What is all this fluid? I don't get it. It's a, Oh my god, look at this! Ah! What is it? What is this? Holy shit. Look at it! For God's sakes, look at it. Holy crap. You know what this looks like? You ever see Judge Dredd when they were making those like evil super soldiers, but they weren't finished yet and they came out of the chamber and their skin was like all sorts of white and sticky? It looks like this, that's what this one reminds me of. It's like eating the disgusting web of human flesh that's just like thumbtacked in and like white and sticky and webby and just stringy. Ugh, God. I don't want to do this. <laughs> I'm probably gonna need this. All right. I don't know if I'm supposed to put broth in here. Should I put some of the broth in here? Am I supposed to heat this up? If I am, then tough noogies on me. Ugh, is there any proper way to pour this without getting it all over the place? All right. I don't know what else to say, but maybe I should take a bigger bite. Because I owe it to you guys, and I don't want to look like a freaking pussy, you know, because I was complaining last time, and then I got what I asked for. Thanks a lot! All right. <laughs> Down the... Oh my god! This is hard! Ugh. 
All right. It tastes like a mixture, like I said, of tuna fish and sauerkraut. I'm, I don't know, I don't know why anyone would voluntarily put themselves in this. Maybe it's like, you know, religion is all about punishment. And no matter what religion, we all have to make sacrifices. <laughs> Holy crap, this, this is giving me, this is, this is giving me flashbacks to the lima beans. Holy, I can't tell what's worse. <sighs> Alright. Thankfully, I got through it. I didn't vomit. I ate almost every morsel. Should I eat this? This will finish it off. All right, I'm gonna try to eat this last bite. Maybe I've developed a gag reflex and I could eat it with no problem. <clears throat> All right, no. And you know what? I think with the lima beans, I eventually developed that, that gag reflex um, and I was able to eat it with no problem. This, I, I have a sneaking kind of feeling, if I were to eat this entire jar, I would never stop gagging. I would never stop bleh, 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 the whole time. And now my breath is absolutely atrocious. Still got all this brine in here. Um, but I, I can't decide what's worse, this or, or, or the lima beans. Obviously, this is zero stars. Zero stars. I don't know why you would eat this. This is going straight in the trash. Mr. Man upstairs, I'm not hungry anymore. In fact, I may never be hungry for the rest of my life. I would be willing to starve to death, then eat some of the things that you send me. Holy crap. Well, now I know what it tastes like. Now, you know, my whole life, when I was alive, I walked by this. Wondering what the hell could this possibly taste like it it looks foul it It almost tastes exactly what it looks like it tastes like poo floating in pee water mixed with a little bit of vomit All right, well, I did that one so you got anything more for me Let me know there's a comment section down below. I'm surprised I got through that uh, You know what I'm gonna go brush my teeth because I don't want to fill the fish breath all day. So, my apologies if this was offensive to anybody. I don't mean to be offend offensive to anyone out there. Um, if you like this, it's, that's great. Eat it, you know. You might eat it with a side of lima beans. I don't know, that's your prerogative. It's just not mine. Um, and, you know, whatever. I, I, 